storm that may force more people to abandon their homes in the village of Shishmoreth. This is home video from a recent storm that washed away several boats and flooded part of the village. Many who live on the barrier island just south of the Arctic Circle say this latest storm has more people talking of moving the village onto the mainland. It was a close call for Stanley Taktu. Waves a terrifying four meters high consumed his home. This is where my old house used to be, a big old long house, so this is what left of it uh, from there to here. Stanley wasn't the only victim. But they're all... As these photos taken by neighbors show, 16 other houses were destroyed. The ground was undercut and then the ground was collapsed. You were losing, like I say, 20 feet of land an hour from the north side. The village no longer has an ice bank to protect its shores. The waves have begun to erode the permafrost, the frozen soil on which Shishmaref is built. To protect themselves, the villagers have built a seawall made of rocks. It cost them around a million dollars. They didn't have enough funding to make this high enough. You, you notice it a lot lower here. Even though it's the beginning of winter, the ice still hasn't frozen. The rising temperatures are disturbing the natural cycle and destabilizing the lives of the Eskimos. 